Once again, I'd like to throw a shout out out there if you're just joining us or if you're watching this on YouTube. Hello, welcome. We are doing some little battles. If you're watching this on YouTube, hello. Fo go ahead, follow on Twitch uh, and fo check the Discord channel. I like to keep some things going active. All right, and predictions are live. What do we got up here? Uh, ooh, they locked in real quick, didn't they? Um, I kind of like Bronzong here, because Trick Room might do me some good. And Terra Steel could do me some good, except against some stuff. Hmm. Although Claude Sire too. Claude Sire might have some good matchup here. Ooh, you know what? Maybe a Claude... Okay. Claude Sire lead. No, Claude Sire in back. Ooh. Magmortar lead. Claude Sire on number two. Pave in the back? Yeah. This is what we're going to go for here. If they lead with some water on their side, I can switch to Claude Sire for a free switch while I'm also kind of scouting them a little bit. <clears throat> All right. Indeedee's coming in. Now, this is the Indeedee with the Psychic Terrain that gets its own. The, I believe the male gets Expanding Force on its own. Neither of my other two Pokemon are good for a switch in here. Uh, you know what? I may need to use my Terra right out the gate. Yeah. Terra Psychic to get some resistance. I j I'm just trying to get a resistance to its Psychic attacks right now. It's it that, that's why I got this. Like, I have Psychic on Magmortar, but it is very much a defensive Terra to get rid of the Fire-type's weaknesses. Especially because the same Magmortar is used on the other team. Yep, there we go. Called it Expanding Force, and thanks to the type change... Although, it looks like I would have survived either way. Still, though, getting that resistance with Choice Scarf Lava Plume definitely helped here, and they just decided to eat the second Lava Plume, um, which tells me they probably don't have anything that's really safe to switch into it. That could be a good sign. That means uh, Magmortar gets a lot of potential to just deal some extra damage before it goes down. And Primarina. Yep, Primarina's coming in. Well, oh, you know what? Well, no, they might not go water now. Although, they might. So yeah, now we switch to Claude Sire. Problem is, Primarina might have Ice Beam, but I doubt it's going to use Ice Beam on this switch here. Oh, crap. Psychic Noise. Oh, oh, but Psychic Noise is a sound-based move, so it becomes Water-type. Nice. Okay. Uh, in that case, I'm going to go ahead and take advantage of this free turn. Okay, they're substituting, so I'm going to go ahead and curse. And I think a plus one from curse is probably enough to get a little bit of uh, a little bit of advantage here, especially because I'm only going to be able to knock out a substitute from the start. Leftovers, yeah, that makes sense. With my Black Sludge and Recover, I could match their healing for a bit. This could be a bit of a, a bit of a stall fest between Substitute Leftovers and uh, Poison Jab Recover. And they can't, so they can't use any sound-based moves. Sound-based moves will all become Water-type. Calm Mind. Okay, they're going Calm Mind. Problem is, Calm Mind doesn't give them much physical strength. So we're going to break the substitute here. Now, at plus one, we should be 
giving some serious pressure here. So either they substitute or they take a devastating blow that they probably can't return much damage with a plus one, whatever they're doing. Yeah, Moonblast. We got massive special bulk plus resistance to Moonblast. And special attack drop does not affect me at all. I'm coming in with physical attacks like Poison Jab. So now they pretty much have to substitute in order to stay alive. Or they switch into something else. Question is, do they have switches that are immune or resistant to poison? Uh, oh, crap. They got the iron thing. Uh, one of those irons. Uh, iron. Crap. Uh, not leaves, not thorns. Not boulder. Crown. Iron crown? Time. 15 seconds. Iron crown is steel psychic. Okay. I'm gonna take a risk on the earthquake. Oh, okay. Okay. I thought maybe they'd be going for... Oh, look, minus two special attack. That doesn't affect me at all. I thought maybe they had one of their irons on the back. I thought maybe if they had iron, iron crown on the back, they could have come in with a poison immunity. So I wanted to let them know, hey, I'm threatening iron crown if you got it. All right, I'm going to take another hit from their Moonblast, but I'm going to go ahead and recover because they can't drop a substitute right now. This is this is just trying to set me up so that when uh, when the next one comes in, Claude Sire still has a very favorable position. Barring Protect, they're not getting another... Uh, yeah, even, with, even if they do have a Protect, they don't get another substitute up. All right. Priority moves are back on the board. Battle was canceled. Okay, they canceled. Whew. 